are you today? My name is Dave Klappenberger. I'm with Klappenberger and Son Painting and Handyman and we are franchising across the country. If you're interested, check out this link below. Let's talk about the Command Benjamin Moore paint. It's brand new. Maybe it's not on, in fact, it's not in my local store, but I did get a gallon of it. Wanted to try it out and see how it works. So I got the white Benjamin Moore Command and you know what? Let's start the review. The Benjamin Moore Command is a waterborne urethane paint that retails for about $55. Okay, it's claimed the fame as it dries quickly, can be recoated in an hour, super duper self leveling, and it can be used just about anywhere. It can be used on concrete steps, commercial doors, kitchen cabinets, bookcases. So it's got this huge variety of applications. That much I like. And I like this paint. It has a lot of really good qualities. But the coverage is one area where it fell short. I compared the coverage of the Benmore Command to six other white semi-gloss paints on different backgrounds just to see how it would compare if it was an off-white background to a dark background to a mid-tone background. How does the coverage compare? And I had six different judges come in and take a look at these white semi-gloss samples and all the judges said two things. One is that Benjamin Moore Ben covered the best and that Command covered the worst. Now how bad is it? Well, it's, it's very likely or very plausible that you're going to have to apply three coats of this paint to get 100% coverage. So is it horrible? No. But it certainly, I would say, is below average. I'm going to give it a 6.5. The workability of this paint is great. The paint works very, brushes very easily, and you can get about 22 to 26 inches out of one dip of a brush and spreading it. I like that. Also, the working time for a paint that dries to the touch in 15 minutes, the fact that you have one minute to go back and touch things up in case there's a drip or a run or you want to hit an extra spot without boogering up the sheen, the finish. That's fantastic. I really like the washability or the workability of this paint. I'm giving it a 10 out of 10. Now, if you like this video, please give us a like below and let's carry on with the washability, durability, self leveling, and final valuation of the paint. Let's go. Washability I put ketchup, mustard, red wine, coffee, pencil, crayon, six things on here after the paint had cured for 14 days. Then I take four different cleaners, spray them on here let it sit on here, wipe it off, all of it came off. Everything came off, there, there was no burnishing done to the paint, there was no evidence that I had cleaned it, it was perfect, 10 out of 10. Washability, 10, durability, 10. How about the self-leveling? How well does a paint dry in 15 minutes? How well can it self-level? Answer, incredibly well, incredibly well. If you brush this, it's almost going to look the same as if you spray it, except for it's going to take you a hell of a lot longer. This paint self-levels almost without it being necessary or beneficial to add a paint conditioner. Beautiful self-leveling. 10 out of 10. The overall value of this paint has to be answered with the price, 55 bucks, and where can I use it? Well, I love the washability, the durability, the self-leveling awesome i'm thinking kitchen cabinets i'm thinking i have to be spraying if i'm brushing and rolling it's going to take two or three coats it's not going to work for me i'm also thinking commercial space like doors any place where i can spray this thing i'm happy with it any place that it, I, it needed to dry quickly i'm thinking about it but if i'm brushing and rolling it man i'm not willing to use this paint if I have to put on an extra coat. It eats up too much in labor cost. So my overall evaluation of this paint is it has some really good benefits, but unless we can get the coverage to be better, which we might be able to by adding a little bit of black into it, but I want to compare everything with their white, everybody's white paint, then I might be able to cover better. But for this evaluation, I have to give it an eight out of 10, even though it got all tens except for coverage, a six. 
If you like this video, give us a like. Thanks so much for watching. See you on the next one.